This video will show you how to buy crypto on crypto.com and move all the cryptocurrency that you've purchased to your trust wallet and will also include how to swap BNB for BNB Smart Chain. You need three apps to complete this video. The first one is crypto.com. This is where we'll buy the cryptocurrency. The second one is trust wallets. That is where we're going to send the cryptocurrency to. And the third one is Google Authenticator, which is used for security. As we go through the video, I'll explain more in detail. Once you've installed the apps, you'll then open up crypto.com. Once you've opened up the app, you'll see the home screen in front of you. This just gives you a breakdown of your balances and all the favorite cryptocurrencies at the moment. If you look at the bottom tab, you'll see a tab called Accounts. If you click on that, it will open up that tab for you. Now when the tab opens up, give it a few seconds to refresh. And if you click Darren's link in the webinar, you should see a balance next to your crypto wallet. That's why I'm showing £18.37 there at the moment. So to go to the next screen, you click on where it says Fiat Wallet to go to add your card to buy crypto. You then select Buy Crypto on the top left and that will open a new tab for you. You then type in BNB, which is short for Binance Coin. And when it comes up, click on that. It will then take you to an option where you can buy BNB. Now at the moment, the tab will be on Fiat Wallet because that's what we chose. But if you look at the screen, on the left hand side, you'll see credit card. If you select credit card, it will open up that tab for you and it will give you the option to add a credit card. If you choose that, you'll be able to add your card details and then select add card. Once you've added your card, it will bring you back to the home screen. You then select accounts again, select Fiat Wallet, select buy crypto, type in BNB for Binance Coin, and there you'll see your card listed at the moment. So what you can then do is choose how many BNB you want to buy and select buy BNB. You'll have to do tick a box called I understand that a 0% fee is required for every card purchase to continue. And then it will give you the confirmation withdrawal, which you then select confirm. You have to enter your passcode at this point. Confirm your CVV number on the back of your card. And there we go my BNB purchase is complete. So if you give it a few seconds after this, your screen will refresh and you'll see your new balance. And there you can see I've bought £51 worth of BNB. Now we're going to send this BNB to our trust wallets. So let's go through those steps. The first thing we do is select crypto wallets the top heading on the screen and if you look on the screen you'll see it says Binance coin you can select that and if you select transfer you'll see an option come up to withdraw or deposit Binance we're going to choose withdraw it'll open up a new screen and we're going to choose the option for external wallets right at the bottom. So on your phone, open the app called Trust Wallets. And what we'll do in there is get the address that we're going to send our BNBs to. So once you open up Trust Wallets, click on the Receive icon in the middle of the screen select BNB 
and then you have the option to copy the address. So on the bottom left hand side, select to copy your trust wallet's address. You then go back into your crypto.com account, put in your password, and there you have the option now to put in your wallet's address. When you're putting in the address, always select no MIMO required for my wallet because uh, when you send to Trust Wallet, it doesn't require that. You then put in a wallet name and click on continue. At this point, it'll open up two-factor authentication. So you select to enable two-factor authentication on the top right. You enter in your passcode. You click to enable two-factor authentication now. You put in your password one more time. It then tells you that you need to install Google Authenticator or any similar app. You copy the code at the bottom underneath the barcode and you then proceed to verify. You'll then open up Google Authenticator and click on the enter a setup key option on the bottom right. You'll see the account and key come up. For the account name type crypto and paste the key that we got from the previous step. Once you've added the account, you'll see that the crypto uh, security is now enabled with a number underneath it. That's the number that we're going to copy and put into the crypto app to, to send BNBs across. So we open up the crypto app once again and we have to re-enter the password. And this is where we paste that, pass, that passcode we just got from Google Authenticator. And there we go two-factor authentication is enabled successfully. So tap anywhere on the screen and then you'll see your uh, option to set up your trust wallet again in the app. So you basically untick MIMO required for my wallets and retick it. Enter your passcode, verify with Google Authenticator once again and put that code in over here. Hit continue. And there we go. We've added our external wallet. So now we're going to withdraw everything that's in crypto.com, all our BNBs, to our trust wallets. So we select withdraw BNB. We put in the amounts that we want to withdraw and select withdraw. We put in our passcode one more time. We put in our Google Authenticator code one more time. We paste it in right there and hit continue. There we go, our BNB withdrawal has been submitted. If we go back to our crypto.com app and click on home and then uh, accounts, we'll see that our BNB value has gone down to zero almost. We then open up Trust Wallet and in Trust Wallet, after a few minutes, we should see our BNB value increase. And as you can see, I've got a, a figure inside there. This could take up to five minutes at some point during busy times. So what we'll do now is because we've got our BNB in our trust wallet, we can swap it for BNB Smart Chain. So let's go through those steps quickly. So we select BNB. We select swap on the top right hand side and we select swap to smart chain. 
then we can choose how much we want to swap to the smart chain and in this example I'm using 100% And then you can see I'm swapping three BNBs for the smart chain BNBs. I then select swap and confirm. It takes a few minutes to process. And once that's done, it's all finished. And that's the entire process done now. If you have any questions uh, that we haven't answered here, please contact us on our Telegram group where we'll be glad to help you. Thank you.